What? What's up everybody, Roderick here with the Sonic G951S Pink gaming headset. Other than looking really cool, these feature 40 millimeter drivers so you can hear high, medium, and low frequencies in extreme detail. They feature a five foot cable with a 3.5 millimeter connector so they have wide compatibility. They have large size earmuffs for passive noise reduction and comfort. They feature a lightweight and self-adjusting headband for comfort over long periods of time. And they even feature removable ears so you can be a kitty cat meow. So let's see what we got. As you can see, we have this super nice looking headset. You can't tell me that doesn't look cool. G951S Pink. And then on the back, we have some product features along with some text specs. Oh yeah. Inside the box we have this, I can't read it, operating instructions, a 3.5 millimeter splitter cable for computers, those detachable soft ears, and then we have the headphones and boy these look nice. They have some nice flex to them, feel very durable. They are completely made out of plastic. Up top we have some Sonic branding. We have this adjustable headband, soft earmuffs. Oh, this just looks super nice, huh? We have the flexible microphone so you can get it to whatever angle you need. On the cable, we do have an inline remote control for volume and muting the microphone, along with that 3.5 millimeter connector. Now, you know we have to do it. You can't not do this. Let's put these on. Oh, they look even better with the ears. Don't at me. And now I'm gonna connect it to my Xbox One. And look, it kind of matches. So if you're like me and have an older Xbox One that doesn't have the 3.5 millimeter connector, you're gonna need either the chat adapter or a chat pad that has a 3.5 millimeter connector on the bottom. And then it's as simple as that. Easy, huh? Before I go test these things out, let's see how well they fit. <sighs> Woo! Well, definitely covering up my ears. Do they look nice? Now, I'm not sure if it's just me because I have a big head or something, but they're not super comfortable. Inside the earmuffs, the actual speaker is pretty hard and I can feel it on my ears when these are on since it's completely wrapping around. Not really that good for me. But now I'm gonna go play a game and see how they sound. They're swarming B. Ah! Ha! What? Ah! Ha ha! <laughs> All right, you guys, just got done playing some Call of Duty because that's the only game I'm relatively good at, so props to me. Now this headset, it's actually really good. The audio is really clear, really crisp, really loud, definitely has that surround sound feel to it. The microphone is great, really sensitive, picks you up even if you're talking quietly, but who talks quietly while they're gaming, am I right? They look super cool, they are comfortable with one exception, and it might be a big one, I guess it might depend on the person. Like I said when I was trying them on initially, the speaker in here is really hard and this wraps around my ear and it's instantly squeezing and pushing the hard speaker onto my ears so it's not too comfortable after playing just one match in call of duty my ears were kind of hurting from that pressure of that hard plastic digging into my ear now i'm not sure if that's because these are made for kids so my head's bigger and it'll squish it a little bit more but that's something you might want to consider other than that which may be because my head's too big these are some great headphones they work really well plug and play in your xbox playstation you name it if you want to pick up a pair of these i'll throw the link down below in the description make sure you guys comment your thoughts down below and let me know if you guys are picking up a pair of these or what your choice of gaming headset is thumbs up red subscribe button social media and i'll see you in the next one